voters today have quite a lot of choice on the ballot paper. There are 16 candidates, but only three of them are likely to get any significant share of the vote. Now, they are Almasbek Atambayev. He's the current prime minister of the present administration. He's a northerner. He is a political veteran. He has the backing of Moscow. Very important for countries in the former Soviet Union. Mr. Atambayev's two main rivals are Kamchibek Tashiev and Adakhan Madumarov. Now, they are very divisive characters. They're popular in the south of the country with Kyrgyz voters. The south still remains extremely tense after the inter-ethnic violence last year, the riots in Uzbek neighborhoods in which more than 400 people were killed. Now, independent polls have put Mr. Atambayev in the lead, but there's a big question mark over whether he has enough support to get more than 50% of the vote. And if not, a second round runoff is possible with his closest rival, Adahan Madomarov. Organizers of this vote say it's going to be very difficult for any cheating because they've tightened up procedures and there are large numbers of independent monitors observing. It's not necessarily what goes on inside the polling stations that could be the deciding factor. If the candidates that are rivaling Mr. Atambayev are unhappy with the result, both men are in a position to bring large numbers of people onto the streets that could threaten the country's fragile stability once again between North and South or between ethnic Kyrgyz and Uzbeks.